this is the project we have developed. It includes one activity and we want to test it. One option is creating a new project, a test project dedicated for testing this one. We ch check the option file, new, and then select the option Android test project. Pressing next and we can name it. I usually name those projects with uh, the same name as the name of the project we want to test suffix with the word test. Now let's select the project in test, the project we want to test. The new project we are now creating will be dedicated for testing uh, this one. And um, we can press finish and here we have a new project and in this new project we can find um, a package its name is the same as the package in the original project only with uh, another uh, level another subdirectory test and we can now create the class that would test um, the simple application activity class. We shall name it the same name only with the suffix test And uh, we shall also specify that it extends the activity instrumentation test case to class. This is a generic class and here we should uh, specify as the parametric type the type of that original activity we want to test. Here we should define a default constructor that includes a call to the super class constructor, to the class from which this class extends, passing over the package name where the activity we want to test resides, as well as a reference for a class object that describes that activity, that specific activity we want to test. The test, um, the tests include methods. Um, each method that tests a specific method in the original activity starts with the word test, followed with the name of the method we want to test. And the setup method is the method that will be invoked for each one of the test methods. Now, if we check the manifest file, here we can find the instrumentation XML element. This XML element is the one that ties between the two projects the original project we want to test and the new one the test project this XML element also specify the instrumentation test runner class as the one that will be used during this test now the second step would be pointing at the new 
project Android, the new test project Android we have just created. Right click, run as, run configuration, and the configuration won't be a, a simple Android application but an Android J unit test. And here we can specify that we want to run all tests in this specific project. Let's press run 